So it's our first day in the morning, just arrived in the office and looking through the order paper for the day, which tells me what's going on in the chamber, as well as my own diary. First thing uh, this morning, there's a local business, uh, Napit, coming down uh, to host an electrical safety roundtable uh, and tell lots of uh, national businesses about the work that they're doing in our constituency. Uh, thank you for making the trip down. You've picked an interesting time to visit. Um, lots going on. Um, my job is to introduce uh, the Chief Executive of NAPIT. As a leading government approved and UK accredited body, uh, NAPIT has been providing a market professionalism and expert support for building services and the fabric sector for over 25 years. It also happens that they employ lots of people in my constituency, so we like them very much. Um, I am doing politics live this morning on the BBC before Prime Minister's questions. At lunchtime. So this is College Green, you can see the pop-up TV studios behind me. I'm just heading a little bit beyond it to Millbank, going to go and talk about, I guess, Brexit, of course. Um, so that's the next thing on my agenda. Uh, then we'll head back over to Parliament for Prime Minister's questions. Kicking the can down the road further, we're already two and a half years into this thing. Um, the biggest challenge that I get from my local businesses, who are largely leave backing actually, um, are, are, is the uncertainty. And if we drag it out for longer, you know, if we can't find a solution before the 29th of March, what chance of finding one after? Back from the BBC, just been to dump stuff in my office and head over to PMQ, so it's like 5 to 12, so we have to kind of run over there pretty quick. We put in every week for Prime Minister's questions, see if we can get called to ask one. Um, along with all the other oral questions um, for departments that happen, uh, don't get drawn very often, it's pretty competitive. You can go and kind of bob. When MPs stand up and down in the chamber all the time, it's because they're trying to get called by the speaker to ask a question. So we're heading over there for PMQs now, um, and we'll catch up with you after. Questions to the Prime Minister. So PMQs is finished, um, same old session to be honest on, on Brexit obviously that we've kind of seen a few times before now, hopefully that's coming to a head and we can get some conclusions in the next few weeks. But um, this afternoon, uh, just checking the diary, heading out now to a number of meetings with uh, lobbyists and colleagues talking particularly about financial education in schools connected with obviously the work I do on the Education Select Committee, meeting the Vice Chancellor of Nottingham Trent University about how we can work together more to deliver um, better education for kids in Mansfield, more opportunities to work with them, with the college, uh, and bring all of that together. And also with Conservative colleagues about um, communities like Mansfield, about how we uh, can deliver for you know, working class communities in, in our part of the world, um, and make sure we're, we're you know, working with people like you more effectively. So, um, lots to do um, before we can uh, head home this evening. I'm off to, uh, to go through those. Just missed the division bell going, rings across the whole of the parliamentary estate. You can see on the screens here, division. If you're voting in the chamber, it means I've got less than eight minutes to leg it from here in the offices over to parliament and make sure uh, I'm voting on the tenants' fees bill. So I'm off. See you in a bit. Many of that opinion say aye. Aye! Of the contrary, no. No! no. Division! Clear the lobby! Meeting's over, heading back up this much more fancy staircase back to the office. Actually, um, folks have finished early tonight, which is a nice change. Sometimes we're stuck here till um, kind of middle of the night, gone 10 o'clock. Um, but tonight we're finished um, here about six, which is nice. So I'm gonna go and try and square away in the office. And as it's Wednesday, um, back to the constituency this evening. Back at the train station and managed to escape from parliament on a Wednesday, which is what I try and do, get back Wednesday night. Uh, too late to see the kids as usual, but. Uh, at least uh, maybe catch my wife before she goes to bed. Um, always try and get back on a Wednesday night if I can. I'd much rather be in the constituency um, the rest of the week than, than down there. So um, in Mansfield tomorrow morning and Friday, uh, looking forward to catching up with everybody the rest of the week.